history is written by, rewritten by the conqueror. And that's one thing that dad always taught as he was a historian. So in uh, finding a, a word for what I'm going to talk about in this lecture, I, you know, I, I chose uh, the struggle to become a human being. I didn't know exactly what I was going to say because I, I uh, wasn't here yet. I, I only could project into the future maybe. You know, I had to f pick a title and I didn't know whether to talk about, maybe I should talk about Mayan prophecy and then everybody would show up or tuning crystals and we'd have a huge audience or <laughs> my favorite guacamole sauce and there'd be just a few people. You know, I just said, well, how many people do I want to hear, to be here? I could make it like a, give it a really bad title and then it'd be a short talk. <laughs> but um, it's really hard to pick something to say uh, until you get here. It's even, you know, it's, and Dad would say, be careful of the words because sometimes, you know, it's how you tell somebody something and they'll hear what they want to hear and it goes on and on and on. Even when I gave out the title for the struggle to become human, even the difficulty in getting a point across is, I mean, even the very first, when we fr first said the, sent the first flyers of what I was going to say, the words changed. Even the very first word, not even, even before I got here, the very first word of the title was changed to from the struggle to become human to struggle to become human, which changes everything about this lecture. So that was the original title that went out. To nobody's fault, but we're just human beings, ha every one of us. Uh, we got to give each other a break for making mistakes and things. It, it's part of our nature to make mistakes. We can't help it. We're not a completed creature yet. And we look at each other with this judgment like we need to be perfect in everything. And our neighbors need to be perfect in everything. And our friends and the people we elect that need to be perfect because we elected them to be perfect and they're not going to be. And not one of us is perfect. You know, uh, I was always taught there was only one person who was made perfect and his own people nailed him to a tree 2,000 years ago. So nobody, nobody here is perfect. We're all, we're all struggling with this in ourselves. We're incomplete creatures. We're two-leggeds. We're trying to become a human being and it's a process that takes a whole lifetime of mistakes to get, to even work half of it out. So, you know, that's, that's the struggle that I'm talking about, becoming a human being. 